Most turtles are slow, but not this turtle. This turtle wears running shoes. Let's draw a turtle with running shoes. Sketch or strong, let's have some fun telling stories. Be sure to press the subscribe button on this channel to get the latest sketching and strumming fun. We'll be using some white paper, a pencil, an eraser, a black marker, and something to color your drawing, like crayons or colored pencils. And remember to put something under your drawing so the black marker doesn't go through your paper onto the table below. We'll start by drawing the shapes of our character with a pencil. We'll draw very lightly because we come back later and trace these lines with a black marker. We'll start with a straight line from side to side and then a big bump on top of that. This is the turtle shell. So a straight line and a big bump on top. And then a little oval off to the side of the shell. That's his head. And then his little neck that attaches to the corner of his shell. And then I'll draw two small circles on the one top end of that oval. Those will be the turtle's eyes. And coming down on the bottom of the shell, that straight line, I'll draw two more lines coming down and put a little bit of a foot shape on the bottom of that. That'll be one of the turtle's legs and his little foot. And then I'll repeat that right behind it. So there are two legs there. And then go to the back of the shell and do the same thing. Draw those two lines coming down with a little foot on the end, straight across from the front feet, and those will be the turtle's back legs. I'll put another one behind the front foot. So now a little turtle has four legs with little feet, and then finish with a couple of curved lines at the back of the turtle's shell, which is his little tail. And those are the shapes we'll use to draw this little turtle character. If your shapes look something like this, then you're ready to go to the next step, which is to trace the pencil lines with our black marker. So I'll draw two small circles, which will be the turtle's eyes. And I'll put a little dot in each one. Those are the pupils. And then I'm going to trace that little oval shape of the turtle's head stopping where the neck attaches, a couple of little nostrils on his nose, a smile with a little cheek line at the top of the smile, and then follow those pencil lines down the neck and attach those to the shell shape. A couple of eyebrows, adding detail as I go. Now I trace the shell, which is a straight line across the bottom, and then the big curved line, or the bump, on the top. First one side, and then I come down the back side, and there's the turtle shell. And then we go to the front leg. I'll draw the curved lines down to the foot. And then a line right across the top of the foot, which will be the top of his shoe. I'll do the same thing to the back leg including that little line as the top of the shoe. Three little shoestring lines on the tops of each of the shoes and a little tongue or the little part of the shoe that sticks up in the middle. Now he's wearing two shoes. Let's do the same thing to the back legs. And then I'll trace the little curved tail. I'll add a little line beneath each shoe, which will be the sole of the shoe. And next we'll add some detail to the turtle shell. We'll draw lines straight up and down, kind of like stripes, 
on the shell. And then we'll draw some more lines side to side, stripes going left to right, which gives us a checkerboard pattern on the turtle's shell. And then I'll draw a line across the bottom to show where the turtle's standing. It can be the ground or the grass. And I'll even add a few more details around his tail. These are called motion marks. Drawing those lines around the tail makes his tail look like it's wagging. Well, we finished the marker drawing. Now we can go back and erase the pencil lines. Those lines were helpful to know where to put the marker lines, but we're finished with the drawing so we can go back and erase all of those pencil lines. And now we have a nice clean marker drawing and it's time to add some color. I'll speed up this part of the video so you get an idea of how I colored the turtle, but you might want to take your time. Have fun! Well, we drew a little turtle in running shoes. That was fun. I'll bet you could think of a story about this little turtle in running shoes. What's your story? Thanks for drawing with me. I think you'll come up with some great stories for these characters. Until next time, when we get together to sketch or strum, we'll have some fun telling stories you can draw. And remember to subscribe to this channel because there's a lot more fun ahead.